this video is about the design of guard ring for a NMOS transistor to avoid the latch up in integrated circuit. For this demonstration, I have considered a NMOS transistor with A as input and VDD supply as input and ground pin which has a width of 600 nanometer. And it is designed from five fingers whose width is 120 nanometer. I want to create a guard ring around it. So check and save the design. Go to the launch, layout Excel, create a new. The view is layout. Click OK. It opens another window. Go to the connectivity, generate all from source. The minimum separation is 0 0.12 and within the PR boundary. I hope pins I want to place on metal one pin not on drawing I want to place it on pin so search for metal one pin click on apply now it will be placed on pin instead of a drawing you can have the label also Click on create as label, go to the options and the label size is the same as the width of the metal one which is 0 0.06. Layer name is same as input pin and the VDD ground and the purpose is label. Click OK. Press Shift F to see the inner content. Now I want to create a guard ring around it. Press S to stretch this PR boundary. Let me move all this aside during the layout. So this is a NMOS transistor with five fingers, one, two, three, four and five. I want to create a guard ring of it. So select the poly, copy this. of equal widths now cover this or connect these terminals with the via which is a metal one poly
connect all this with the metal one align them now the pin is a place this Whether the routing is done in a proper way or not, you can observe it by going into the window, click on assistance and navigate it. You can see this, A is connected to all the terminals in a proper way. Now we need to connect the ground and VDD. So you can connect the VDD not directly I'll use metal one metal to via because all are this VDD this is a VDD and this is also VDD Over this, directly pass the metal to select the metal to and select the width of this to zero point. One two. Twice the width of the metal one. Now you place the VDD over to this line. Observe that this is in a red color and this is in a blue. Blue indicates it is a metal one. This is metal two. Change the pin by pressing Q to metal 2 metal 2 pin click on ok if you want you can leave the text or you can change it to label as metal 2 now you can see VDD is also connected properly now you need to connect only the ground pin you can shift this A onto this Now I am going to create the guard ring for this entire cell, for this entire NMOS. So first select this design of NMOS. If you want you can reduce this space in between. Press M. to save the space then first select this design then go to create and click on MPP guard ring or use shift G this is how a guard ring looks for this NMOS transistor since it is a NMOS select p tab and the guard ring could be a rectangular or rectilinear 
right now whatever you are seeing it is a rectilinear and enclosure you can provide the enclosure to 0 0.5 of choice whatever the space you want you can see this and the net name has to be ground not ground because that was the only pin that is left out for the design now this is the guard ring for the design you can directly place over this if you want to reduce this you can do that you can move it or if you want you can draw from the scratch let me delete this go to the create mpp god ring i want to have it a p tab because it is a nmos and now this time i am going to reduce this space to 0 0.25 i want to have a rectangular or rectilinear click on apply click on apply hide for before that you need to select this device where you want to make the god ring select this go to the now it is done okay you can shift this pin ground onto this Still the connection is not complete because it is being shown here that ground has to be connected. So select the metal one. You can directly connect here or I will show you. Connect this. Again this has to be connected. If you want you can go in this direction also. This one has to be connected. Observe that it is clean. All the pins are properly connected. And you can arrange the PR boundary based on the requirement. You can change this. You can increase this. And you can move the design or else you can change this design to connectivity let me go with the rectilinear design p tap this time i want to have a rectilinear and of 0 0.2 size and i want to have a net name on this as ground click apply ok before that you need to select this design create apply ok need to connect all this select this path and this one this is also correct you can reduce the space inside based on the requirement this is how you 
use the guard ring to avoid the latch up problems in integrated circuit 